Okay, I'm about to tell you what's going on in my family right now. I know some of y'all about to be like, that's your family, that's your blood. Why you breaking this to the internet, man? Fuck that. I'm about to say what I'm about to say. I'm sick of people trying me. Okay, so I got an older sister, y'all. She's like 28 years old. I don't know why, but I feel like she low-key hates me. Like, I've never done nothing to this girl ever, y'all, but love her and take care of my nieces. I don't know what I've ever done for this bitch to act like I'm just a bitch in the streets, but let's get into it. Okay, so my mom got five kids, and every single one of us got different fathers. Don't judge my mama, ho. Judge your mama before. Girl, girl. Anyways, with that being said, all of us got different fathers, so the rest of their fathers were deadbeats. I don't like my father, but I'm going to give him his props. Like, he did his big one. Like, he was not no deadbeat. His side of the family is not no deadbeats. My grandma, his mama, everybody helped raise me. Aunties, all that. They always gifted me phones, clothes, shoes, all that. Mind y'all, the rest of my siblings' fathers are deadbeats. So, they kept seeing me growing up with this, that, and the third. And they don't have it. So, it starts to turn into hate. It turns into envy. It turns into jealousy amongst siblings. Blood. Fast forward, we're all adults, y'all, and they still feel like I'm spoiled. Everything I have is handed down to me, y'all. I have my own apartment. I pay every single bill up in this bitch. I didn't get no CPN. I don't have no roommate, and I'm not on Section 8. Everything that comes in and out of this house, I pay for cash myself or my good-ass credit. Okay, so anyways, my mama, she gifted me a couch for my little move-in, you know, for a little congratulations for moving in your own apartment type shit. So, I don't know why my siblings felt so fucking mad when she did that, but it was conversations on the phone. It was, oh, you giving her this, you giving her, but you'll never, you'll never give me this, you'll never give me this. Why is it always an issue when our mother gives her other child something? When y'all bitches be getting stuff, it's quiet, it's, mal it's mute, because I don't give a fuck. But why when she gives me something... Uh, you always, you always, you always like, shut the fuck up. And it's like, my sister, she will hang around bitches that don't like me. She will hang around people that want to fight me. She will hang around people that I do not like. I don't know, no other siblings that do that. But her, it's weird. She loves her friends more than she loves her family, y'all. This some real shit. She will fight for her friends before she fight for her family. People that been there when, when she was at rock bottom. People that, ooh, girl, I didn't, ooh, woo. And it's like, I'm done. Like, I'm done trying to force a relationship with my siblings. I'm done. Y'all hate me. I don't know. Well, I know why. But y'all hate me for some shit that I couldn't even help. I couldn't even change the shit. Y'all cannot be mad at me that I grew up having stuff and y'all did not. Y'all cannot be mad at that. But at the end of the day, I'm not about to force no relationship. A bitch not about to play in my face. And then she had the audacity to argue on the phone with my mama. Because one thing about my mama, she gonna, she gonna, she gonna protect her kid. One thing about my she gonna defend her kids. She'll knock you butt by her kids. Yeah, yeah, Miss Nika, girl, that's my mama, yeah, period. So she on the phone arguing with my mama. She calling me all type of, she calling me a boy, saying this, that, and the third. But mind y'all, every time I'm around my sister, it's nothing but love. It be no pressure, no animosity, no none of that. I be hearing about what she be saying, my mama be telling me. You wouldn't even press the issue with me for real. You press the issue with my mama. Like, girl, what the fuck is it giving?